boy, do I have a story to tell you. So this interesting experience I had with the seller recently, a couple of weeks ago, I decided to send out um, letters in this particular neighborhood asking the homeowner if they wanted to sell their house because I do have a legitimate buyer who's motivated to make a purchase. Soon after, I got a call from this elderly gentleman asking for my help to, you know, list his small um, rental portfolio. I was so ecstatic. I was excited. Didn't waste any time, started doing the research, you know, just want to make sure everything was legit and verify that the seller was indeed the rightful owner of the property. And also double checking his background, right? And then I quickly um, went out to meet with him um, at one of his rentals. And, you know, we had a big conversation. Um, we agreed upon the listing price and, you know, the market strategy and everything else. So went home, started um, my listing agreement. And I was in shock because this very um, property was active on the market like yesterday along with his other rental. So I'm like, hello, Mr. Seller, what is going on? Why um, is this property on the market already? Do you know this listing agent? He goes, yes, I do. Why? I said, well, sir, um, I can't help you. He said, why not? I said, because you can't have multiple agent list for the same property. He said, well, I talked to that agent and she said, there would be an issue. And I say, well, no, along the line somewhere, you probably signed that listing agreement saying that it's exclusively listed with them and their brokerage. So therefore, 